Hey Lightweights, and welcome back to some more GTA 4 The Lost and Damned. Ash? Johnny boy. John, I need some help. I ain't got a handout for you. Sorry. A handout ain't gonna fix it, Johnny boy. I'm into something bad. I need a knight in shining armor to take me away from this mess. They're gonna kill me. Or worse. Jesus, Ash. Where are you? Project on Wardite. Come quick, baby. I'll try. Okay, well, I was going to go to Stubbs, but uh, we're not going to do that now, obviously. <laughs> Oh no. I remember this place from Nico's days. I had a big shootout here that I really struggled with as Nico. Oh my lord. I'm not ready. That's not the door. Do I need the elevator? There's no elevator. Where are the stairs? Right here. Who sent you? What the fuck are you doing here? I don't need this shit! Okay, that's not- that's not where Ashley is. Hey! What the fuck is that? Don't fuck with me. Nobody yeah, I can do me. that too. I can't do that. I don't know how to do that. Why was that not working? Oh my god. Well, this is starting off real well, in case you were wondering. It's just starting off. This is the worst. I'm not fucking set. This is too easy. No, we are not. We are not. Why did you take cover? on that side of the wall and not that side of the wall that makes no fucking sense oh my god <laughs> suck my dick suck your what what was that you want to say that again i've come for you baby don't worry no more Die? Huh? Huh? Ah. Dude, get the ah. fuck out of here, you druggie. My boyfriend's gonna splatter your brains across this place. You sure know how to get yourself into trouble, don't you, baby? You sure know how to get me out, Johnny. Come here. What's wrong? I don't want to hang out here. Can we go? I don't want to hang here neither. 
Then again, I'm not the one messing up my head on a week-long ice binge. I remember when you used to mess around at my place. That don't happen anymore, either. Take me home, man. I'm crashing hard. I don't know, maybe we should drop her off at rehab. Show me what you got, boy! You all right? I'm with you now, Johnny boy. How could I not be? How long you been up? Two days? Three? Who's counting? It ain't good for you. You know that. Sure, sure. Do you expect me to stay clean when you're not there to look after me? Maybe if you answered your calls. Fuck. Whatever. I was gonna say, I didn't think okay. we were together anymore. I'm bad, baby. I'm bad. I know it. You should teach me a lesson. Hit me or something. Teach me I'm wrong. Enough of that. Teach me, baby. It's the only way I'll learn. Make me hurt. You're making yourself hurt already, you fucking idiot. Hit me. Give me a break, sweetheart. I used to fucking love you. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> You're too sweet for words, Johnny boy. You think I'm sweet too? You ain't good for me, sugar. That's all I know. Hmm. Nice place you got here, sugar. Not now, honey. I ain't feeling so good. I thought you said you stopped smoking that stuff. I did, Johnny boy. I did. I promise. I never lied to you. Come on, baby. That's crap. <laughs> you know it. I never lied to you when I was sober. Well, my whole life's fallen to shit, sweetheart. I guess it was dumb of me to think this would be any different. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know I ain't much, but I'm all yours. You do know that, baby, don't you? You say so. I love you, Johnny. Thanks for saving me again. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you know what? We're better than this. We can we can live better than this. Yeah, well, let's hope so. Say the word, honey. Take that bike, we'll ride off into the sunset, you and me. You, <coughs> me, and that little habit of yours. You're my habit, Johnny. <coughs> and you're ridiculous. Don't go back to her, Johnny. Just gotta get cleaned up first. She's gonna drag you right down with her. Back. Wait, I should. I should. Johnny, it's Jim. You wanna roll on some dead beats? What a fantastic idea, James. I'll see you at yours. Great, man. See you soon. A gang war? Go to that location to meet with other lost members. In gang wars, you will battle with other gangs. or various gang wars around the city. Alright, I don't think I have to do that right now, though. Sounds fun. Oh, shit. I should have gotten armor first. Hey, baby. Uh, I'm nowhere near one. Shit. <laughs> This is not gonna go well. Maybe I'll be able to get some after I talk to him. Ah, Mr. Stubbs is expecting you. Hey, how you doing, man? Oh, yes, sir. Um, hello, sir. I'm fine. Good. Hey, let me ask you something. Do you really enjoy life? I don't really know what you mean, sir. I mean, to serving all these rich morons, you know, smell of money and all that stuff, you know. Does that make you happy? <laughs> yes, sir, something like that. And tell me, sir, are you happy? I mean, has giving the man the, uh, finger really satisfied some inner urge within you, sir? Well, I think what I've learned is that there's always a man, dude. He just wears a different uniform. Uh, as you say, sir. Uh, Mr. Stubbs is <laughs> in the steam. <laughs> He's like, okay, right anyways. Clevitz! How you doing, sport? Hey, I'm fully clothed in a steam room with a murdering politician. <laughs> well, my whole hey, at least life falls to shit thing. all around me. But fuck it, I'm all right. Miss your uncle? Oh, I've doubled up on the therapy. Change your therapist. No, oh, but I've been seeing Dr. White since I was seven. Man's a genius. Okay, what can I do for you, man? I'm not really dressed for this, and you said it was urgent. Yes, well... <clears throat> There's been a, a clerical error down in the deepest recesses of the Civic Citadel. A group of outstanding civilians, voters, have mistakenly been 
taken into LC PD custody. Well, isn't there something you could do about that yourself, man? Pull some strings or something? No, I'm afraid not, Sport. Way too far down the line for that. Too much red tape. Yada, yada, yada. No, all you need to know is that uh, these gentlemen are in a prison transport bus, and you, my friend, need to liberate them. Sure, I got it. Now, the bus is at the Leftwood Police Station. Now, get them out of there, and we will make it worth your while. Okay. I got it. Don't sweat it, Clebitz. <laughs> This guy. Alright, let's see if there's a... There's not. Of course there's not. <laughs> of course there's not! I wonder if I can buy... What is this? Harvesting. It looked like a flashlight! I wonder if I can buy armor from that gun dealer guy in my phone. Uh, I forget who it is. Hey, Terry! You still got that hardware? No problem, Johnny. I'll be over soon. I don't know if he's actually gonna sell armor, but we're gonna at least try. Johnny, good to see you. Long time no see. I reckon I'm better equipped here than our boys overseas. Fucking disgrace. Ta-da! Terry, man, you're cool. That looks like armor. Okay, this is cool. <clears throat> Rock and roll! A grenade launcher. I don't have enough money. So that could be helpful. Okay, I think that's probably Bye, it. Bye, my brother. Go have fun with that, Johnny. Thanks, Terry. Overalls chafing you? Oh, you must be used to wearing Perseus suits and shit. Look, it was a victimless crime. My taxes pay your salary. Long way from the exchange now, aren't you? You yuppie pricks. Still think you're better than guys like me, huh? You should be put down. I saw what you did to that orderly. The man's organs ain't meant to look like that. Come on! What is he, a cannibal? Um, Shit follows me around, man. <laughs> I had a student say that to me. My parents' tax dollars pay your salary. <laughs> okay. I need to go in there. I'm thinking maybe going the back way is probably better. Go around this way. Yes. 
Oh, shit. Maybe not. Damn it! <laughs> Here I am, thinking I'm gonna work smarter, not harder. They teach us oh! How to use these sun <laughs> I didn't even see him there! <laughs> okay. I guess I have to go the other way. Now that they're all running out here at me. You're in my world now, son. Eat dirt, people! Okay. You just crossed a line, shitty. You're going down! This is your last warning. Get down! I'm gonna shoot you! Oh my god, he is Whoa. a cannibal. You're the best tasting thing I've had since I got locked up. That's intense. All right, since we've all uh, eaten, we've got a new <laughs> destination, people. How is he handling that so well?
I see the edge. I see the edge. I see the edge. Do me a favor. Don't fucking eat me back there. Please, 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 please. No! Shit. Shit, please, 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 please. Shut it, you beast. Oh. I'm trying to think. There's a boat waiting behind the Glow Oil Plant in Actor Industrial. Way too close. That was way too close. Oh my god. That was the worst. I don't know how I did that first try. Shit. Oh, how there's like not an APP out or so anything. It's like, hey, we lost them. For? Guess we give for up. These fellas, it's white collar shenanigans. Caught with their hand in the cookie jar. My greed was of a uh, more corporeal nature. I'm gonna take that as meaning you were into some sick shit. Let's not discuss it. As you wish, dear boy. I'm guessing it wasn't you I got paid to bail out anyway. I doubt those who remember me think it a great idea that I am about to be roaming free again. Okie dokie there. You're blocking this whole... Is this supposed to be like Hannibal Lecter or something? Really not easy to drive. It's like very floaty and top heavy and doesn't want to turn. Thank you, sir. My fellow prisoners and I are most grateful. We've got a boat to catch. Oh, I do like to be beside the seaside. Oh, I do like to be beside the sea. Oh, I do like to walk along the from 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 where the brass band plays fiddly bum 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 bum. Bon voyage. I would not want to be on that guy's boat. I'd be like, nope, get me on a different fucking boat. <laughs> I'm not riding with this guy. Your friends are out to sea, Mr. Stubbs. Good luck to them. I think they'll need it. Oh, don't you worry. Those boys don't need luck. You should have seen them in 73. Believe me, a short recession and a trip to Panama isn't going to finish those boys off. All traitors by blood. Great genes. I was thinking the problem might lie with one of the other passengers on their little cruise. Later on, Mr. Congressman. Okay. <laughs> I don't think I have anything else that is up yet, so we're just gonna head over to this gang war, and then if something pops up on the way, we will do it. And uh, I think I'm gonna steal this guy's car, because I don't know where my bike is. We need your input and a discussion, John. Come to the house. Okay, I guess that answers that then. We're gonna go here. Hello there, James. How you doing? Getting through it, brother. Just about. Listen, that guy we stole those <laughs> Angels of Death bikes for, he's got a whole shopping list of bikes he wants. <gasps> you interested in procuring them for him? As long as it ain't gonna get us in the shit with any more dirty cops. Them cops ain't around no more. Get Angus on the wire when you're ready to roll. He's got the details. So long, brother. Deodorant. You're fucking right. 
The shit's cursed. Man, I just don't see how we have a choice, man. I have a choice. I'm free. I'm not a slave. I have a choice. Jim, I love you, man, but since you've hit middle age, you really lost something. Yeah, and since you've fucking been strung out on this shit, you've lost something. You fucking mind. Easy, Jim. Look who the fuck you're speaking to, huh? Hey. What's up? I'm just trying to explain to our friend here that possession is nine-tenths of the law. We should make the slopes pay us back. Billy, I got Chad on the phone. Pay us back for what? Look, we have a business opportunity here, Johnny. You think a guy like you should be pleased? Yeah, but Jim says there's some problem. There is. That H we stole. It belonged to the Chinese. The deadbeats told them we got it and they want it back. So? Fuck them. Finally! Billy, Chad's on the phone about the meeting. Look, normally I'd be down for that, but these aren't the type of dudes you just say fuck them to. There's some heavily armed, pissed off motherfuckers who killed a couple of angels when they found out this shit was gone. Now I'm thinking maybe we could strike up a deal with Okay. Okay. Yeah, why don't you just suck him off while you're at it? <laughs> and tell Chad I'm sober as can be over here! That's what I told Look, him! Look, I just think that given this war we're back into with the Angels of Death, and given the fact that one or possibly two government agencies are looking into our shit, that offloading the heroin would be a good idea, all right? And looking for a fight is the wrong thing to do right now, given the fact that we can't even stop fighting amongst ourselves. Yeah, you're right. We should probably all get in a circle, hold hands, pray, sing kumbaya. Kumbaya. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> this ain't no joking matter, Billy. We'll either end up dead in the ground or back in the lockup with you. I ain't going back there. I'd rather be dead. Damn straight. Well, you don't have to do either, man. I just think that getting rid of that stuff now is the right thing to do. Okay.
Well, Bill, I may have beat you, but you're still the fucking man in my book. Why? <laughs> he shouldn't be. All right, Jim, Johnny. Since you two were both so vocal in your support of this deal, you two are going to be the ones to hand over the brown to the slopes. What? Are you and your boy here going to be? I recognize this place too. Are going to watch your backs because unlike this fat man here, I just don't trust those little yellow bastards. Good luck. Hey, they don't need luck. We're looking out for them. <laughs> this better be cool, man. So, Johnny, this is, uh, mm. Not the place I was thinking of. Okay. We gotta be cool and do this thing? So let me get this straight. You are here to sell us back our heroin. The heroin my cousin sweated over in order to bring to this country only to have it stolen. Look, man, we can do business or go to war. Do your call. In this country, they seem to be the same thing, you stupid pieces of shit! Fuck you! Getting out ain't gonna be easy! Where's fucking Bill? He just jumped off a rooftop? Shit. The fuck? I'll rip your head off! I'm going for you! For you. Where you gonna go? We have to You are me! Sorry, I crack myself up sometimes. Not that guy, this guy. Get out of my way! Take Come on, way. assholes! Uh, 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 uh. alarm to stop now. I need an armor, not health. Oh, they're sliding out. Got it. Kill me already! Come on, man, let's go! Wow, that was effective. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay. Did it. <laughs> I was having flashbacks to freaking 
my time with Nico when I could not figure out how to work the ladders. Much more successful this time. Oh, Joy. Joy. You set me up, Johnny. You set me up. Put your hands in the air. Now. Fuck you, Johnny. You're dead. Shut your goddamn mouth. Shut your mouth. How did we set him up? Shit's fucked. Billy's been taken down. Where are you? Bill, yeah, he's fucked out. Thanks to you. I'm around the corner. We're coming. Wait there. Let's get back to the bikes. It's Brian. He's a rat. Never liked that guy. What was all that about? I don't know, man. Billy sounded pissed. He's gonna have plenty of time to think about his anger on the inside. Why'd he bring me into it? We got more important things to think about. Without Billy, we got no leader. You're gonna have to take charge of the chapter, man. It's like being made captain of a sinking ship. What am I gonna do? You're gonna stick by your brothers. We gotta pull together now. You're right about that. Let's see what Brian's got to say for himself. Suspect William Gray what is happening with that car horn? Units back down. Leibitz, man, what the fuck? What happened back there? Get your cock out of Why are you asking me? I'm not the one who got arrested. You were with the guy who got arrested. Like, where the fuck were you? You mean to tell me you were not the rat? Heavy man, fuck it. What was Billy's fucking problem? <laughs> Nothing wrong with him, buddy. You two want us to end up all dead? Man, Billy was right about you. I knew you were a rat. Now he's gone, man. He ain't gone, Brian. He's gone to prison. He's not dead. You ratted him out. You ratted him out. No, I didn't. He nearly got me fucking killed. You set us up. You always wanted to be the one, the man. You're a gift, John. You're giving a fucking Judas. What the fuck are you talking about, you ass kissing little weasel? Hey, Brian. 
Johnny's not like that, Jim. Jim, you're wrong, man. I know you're a good guy, but this dude prick, he fucked us over, man. He set us up and he called the cops. And you know why? Because they're putting heat on him. They saw him and they've been calling him. I know because they did the same to me. And they told me you ratted us out. You keep talking like that, you are dead, my little friend. Fuck you, man. What? You sent Billy to jail, huh? Show us your phone. Prove you ain't been speaking to the law. I don't prove shit to you. And I didn't talk to no one. Fuck it. Come on! You stay away from us, you hear? Jim, I guess I gotta take over as chapter president now. When people hear about Billy going down, there's gonna be more pressure on us than ever. We gotta get through it. Brothers for life, man. Lost forever. I'll see you soon. Why aren't we asking me to see his phone? I, he's just so guilty. What the fuck? Oh my god. Hey, Jim's got a full bar. Clement? Clement, you there? I'm here. What can I do you for, Congressman? Oh, listen, Clement. The taxpayer is picking up the bill for this call, so I'm going to make it brief. The amount of help I need from a man with your skills has tripled in volume, and that's a conservative estimate. If you're interested in helping me out with this, you can call me, and I'll tell you what I need. The pay will be more than adequate. Once you go down the dark path, it just keeps going, don't it, Stubbs? I'll call if I feel the need to keep you in the lifestyle to which you're accustomed. I'm just an American. I like an American bike. Yeah, I understand. You older, Grandpa, so you like a more sedate ride. Some older, mature <laughs> shit. <laughs> give me that. I give you mature <laughs> shit, Mouth. <laughs> Yeah. Hey! <laughs> Ew, who that? Malk. Deshaun, Johnny, brother of mine. All right. Hey, what's up? Malk's got us a connection, Johnny. I'm good, man. I don't need one of them hair dryers. Oh, oh yeah? You sure now? No, no. That's some <laughs> serious hardware. Malk's got us a connection that ain't got nothing to do with bikes. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Explosives. That's right. Okay. With this, we could take the angels of death out of business for a long, long time. Oh, you think? With that, it looks like we could take the whole fucking town out of business. Motherfucker, <laughs> right? That's what you say. Are you down? Oh, man, you gotta ask a question like that? Looks like you're going senile or something, man. That's what I thought you'd say. <laughs> Yo, you fools have fun. But remember this. You get in any trouble, you ain't meet me. Malk, I don't know where you got that shit, man. But one thing's for sure. We will have fun. All right, play nice. Be son. Later, him out. Hey. Later. Use the pipe bombs to blow up the Angel of Death fans. What the fuck? All right. Oh, they're driving around. Come on. Where are you? I saw the the circle on the mini map, but I thought that was a different one. Shit, it's one of the losers. We're out of here. Oh god. Wait. You throw it in front. Oh my god. Before I'm done, what? This is bullshit. What happens if I run out of pipe bombs? Finally. Oh, 
Oh my god, that took like half of them just to get one. I don't know how to change to my regular gun when I'm on the bike. Let's make this murder change. Oh, oh let's see that. now. Come on. Get out of here. Press X. Oh, there we go. Okay. Thanks for telling me now that I've died 50 times. alive in the van when they blew it up. Man, I think the is trying to Listen, not the spirit with which they wanted you to do it, but it's the only way I can do it. So. <laughs> I don't care. Oh my god, break. Fuck.
And let me turn the fucking camera. Come on, motherfuckers! I will pay the old king with your blood. Bring it here! Bring it here, motherfuckers! Dude, the fact that I can't fucking get this guy so It's not that hard, Tegan. Get your shit together. I'm gonna stop there. Um, <laughs> For every moment where I'm like, I'm having a ton of fun with this game, there are moments where I'm like, I, it's just old. <laughs> and I know I say that every outro. I am having fun overall, but I feel like there are just so many missions where it just feels fucking old. And I don't know why, maybe I'm not noticing it more with the DLC, it's just because it's been so long since I played, like, the base game of 4, but it feels like I'm having those moments more and more now as I progress, which is interesting because in the first video, I noticed it way less, but the missions in particular for today, it was very noticeable, the age. Um, obviously, like, just the bomb mechanics were just... Uh, there's, it's, it's so, like, it's a simple thing. Being able to just, like, throw the bomb in the window. I feel like, maybe I'm making this up now. I don't know. I felt like in GTA 5 we had to do something similar, but it was way easier to blow up cars in GTA 5 than it was in this. Um, so the fact that I had to, like, kill all of the people just to be able to blow it up, and obviously that was user error. Like, I totally, I totally am taking accountability for that. I know, I know that a lot of you are going to be, like, pulling your hair out watching that part. Because you're like, it was not that hard. I fucking couldn't do it. So listen, I did it the way I could. And I'm going to bitch about it because <laughs> because I can. Um, 
but yeah, overall, like I'm still having fun with it. It's, it's, I just, uh, <laughs> I was just annoyed this video. Um, but I am super invested in the story. That's for dang sure. I'm super invested to know who actually is the rat. I'm convinced it's Brian. I'm convinced it's Brian. Um, there's no way he got out of that unscathed when he was the one who was supposed to be with Billy and like providing our backup. And now he's trying to turn around on us and he's like, oh, I know they've been in talks with Johnny because they told me that when they talked to me. So like he just admitted to the fact that the cops have talked to him and I know Brian is a weasel. So like he's going to do whatever he needs to do to stay out of trouble. And he thinks, oh, I'll just pawn it off on Johnny because I can't. I don't fucking know. But I'm super excited. I know I say this every video too, but I'm super excited to have the Johnny and Nico crossovers. It's cool how like there have been a couple of times in this video, I think, where I was like, wait, I went to this as Nico. Wait, I've been there as Nico. Um, but I'm most excited for that museum. What is the museum? Where we feel like Johnny betrayed us there. But Johnny, like, you guys said, don't hate Johnny. He didn't betray you. But at that moment, I was like, no, Johnny fucking betrayed us. There's no way he didn't because every time he's involved, shit hits the fan. So I'm excited to see the other side of that. I just want to get to that point. I just want to get to that point because I'm invested in the story. For all of the complaints I have about the mechanics and the game feeling, feeling old, I 100% am in on the story. And I am loving that. Um, Ashley needs to get the hell out of here. <laughs> we don't need Ashley in our lives anymore. Shoo. Good riddance. Good riddance. Go get help. And after you're clean, don't come back to us because we don't need that in our lives. Um, but yeah, the story is great. And I'm having fun with it, even though I'm bitching a lot. <laughs> I know it might not seem like it, but I promise I am. I hope you enjoyed the video. I apologize that this one took so long. Thank you so much for being understanding. I know I've explained it to you all a million times, but um, between the new PC, childcare issues, it's just, it's been very difficult to get anything done, um, especially now that I'm streaming, because those nights would typically be nights that I would use to catch up on, like when I didn't have childcare, I would use those nights to record and edit instead. Um, so thank you guys for always being super understanding about that. And I apologize for those of you who this is like the only series you're watching on the channel. I apologize. It's been such a long time. Um, and hopefully from here on out, it will be better. <laughs> uh, but thank you for understanding. It's not easy being a work from home mom who doesn't have childcare, uh, besides like for two hours, three days a week. And it's my grandparents and they're older and they have medical issues and they have doctor's appointments and they're watching baby light for free. So I have like no right to ever complain or be upset when they don't want to or can't take her. Um, but unfortunately, that just means it messes up the work schedule. But that's kind of my life right now. So um, it'll get better as she gets older. But for now, it is what it is. And I do what I can. And I appreciate you guys all understanding that and um, being patient while I get that all sorted out. So thank you very much for that. I really do hope you enjoyed the video. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button when you do so that you know how to post future videos. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and I hope you have an amazing day.